Hello friends, I just wanted to take a minute to talk to you about Jenny Ferguson's novel Border Markers, published by New West Press this fall. Um, full disclosure, I worked at New West Press during the production and publication of Border Markers, um, but that in no way sort of colors my thoughts on the book, and I just thought it was worth sharing, so here we go. So Border Markers is set in Lloydminster, which is a city that straddles the border of uh, Saskatchewan and Alberta. And in this novel, uh, residents of the city are kind of navigating the ripple effects of a teenager's untimely death. So, for example, we have Poppy, who was dating um, this boy who died, who is kind of traveling in order to escape the literal, question mark, ghost of, um, of the deceased youth. And then there is Chuck, who um, is this boy's guilt-ridden slash incarcerated friend who feels as though he was responsible for the death. There is an entire cast of characters who are attempting to find meaning in what appear to be commonplace lives. So this novel is told through 33 flash fiction fragments, um, and what it does is it, it presents a really um, broad and complex narrative in very precise form. So it's been described as prairie noir, and it, it does uh, portray the complexity and darkness of, of um, lives that may otherwise seem ordinary. So uh, if that's something that interests you, um, then I would re recommend checking it out. So I enjoyed it. I read it over the course of an hour, and if you're looking for some new gritty canlet, um, then why not give it a try? Again, um, you know, I worked at New West during the production of this novel, but I no longer work there, so I have no real stake in it. So this is uh, straight up legit. So let me know if you give it a try. Um, otherwise, I'll see you soon. Okay, bye.